Well, good day everybody and welcome to Dreamfall Chapters. I've been wanting to play this game for an extremely long time while well, it's not... Well, it is a game, but it's more like your typical telltale game. But I've been wanting to play this for so long, I never really could because it was really expensive. But I got it now, so let's go see what this story has in store for us. So, sit back, grab some popcorn, and enjoy! There are two worlds. Our world, the world of science, and Arcadia, the world of magic. Dreams connect these parallel worlds, but a dark force threatens the very fabric of dreams. Zoe Castillo holds the power to shape dreams and save us from the undreaming, but she is trapped in a place called the story time. Kian Alvane is destined to play an important role in the war to come, but he faces execution for treason against his own people. They are both about to be reborn. A new story is about to begin. Their paths will intersect, and at the end of their journey, they will face the Thief of Dreams.
They say that every story has a beginning and an end, but that isn't always the case. Some stories simply stop. My name is Zoe Castillo. I'm dying. I've been in a coma for over a year. The doctors don't believe I'll ever wake up again. My mother did this to me. She put me here so that I wouldn't be able to tell my story, so that she could keep her secrets. It worked. The world is addicted to dreams, to dream time. It's just entertainment. They have no idea what the dream machine is really for and what it's doing to the world. They don't know that someone is stealing their dreams, using them to reshape reality. So, if I'm in a coma, how am I talking to you? The thing is, my body may be here in a hospital, but my mind. My mind is elsewhere. This is the story time. It's the place between. And it's my home now. This place where all stories begin and end, including mine. This is off to an interesting start. And look at the graphics. Wow. That's... Wow, that looks so good. Damn. So we're in a coma, and we're basically in a dream. Hmm. I don't know if the chart is accurate or just a dream construct, but it doesn't look good. That line should be pointing up, not down. That was taken when Reza and I were still dating. Feels like a different lifetime. And, well, it sort of was. People keep bringing flowers. So funereal. Wonkers, my old Wattilla. What the hell's a Wattilla? Is that a name for a pink monkey? Well, to be honest, now that I look at him, he doesn't really look like a real monkey, though. Dad, Gabriel, stops by every day. He keeps apologizing. I wish he wouldn't. That machine is all that stands between me and six feet under. It feeds my comatose body a fun cocktail of life-saving narcotics. So lose that, and this game is actually over. That's a creepy thought. Somebody just has to walk over to it and press the button, I would assume. Oh, what the hell is this? I hear her calling out for help. She's trapped in a looping night terror. I have to help her. There's no one else. It's what I do. In the blink of an eye, I can enter her dream and pull her out. It's pretty cool, actually. Well, it sounds cool. I wish I could enter somebody else's dream. Although, we would see some preferred ship from time to time, I guess. In the blink of an eye, I can enter her dream and pull her out. It's pretty cool, actually.
okay, somebody was just falling. Oh, hey. Help me! Okay. What do you need help with? <laughs> Probably to stop falling. No! Okay. Ah! God! I can't grab her, she's falling too quickly. Okay. So I have to press the button earlier. Let's try that. Oh, what the hell is this? Mind? She's out of control. Completely overwhelmed. She'll just keep falling. She won't be able to escape the loop without my intervention. Okay, okay, let's uh, intervene with this one. Oh god, no! What's this? Light? And time. I'll go for time. Hold on. Oh god, don't let go! Thanks for... for saving me. Feels like I've been falling forever. What is this place? A bad dream. I'm here to help you wake up. Okay. Okay, it's just a dream. It's just a dream. I could have sworn it was... This feels so real. In a few moments, it won't. You'll forget all about it. But I want you to remember one thing. Stop using that thing, the dream machine. Stop using it or you'll be back and maybe I won't find you next time and maybe you'll be stuck in a nightmare forever. Oh God, no, no, I promise I'll remember. Do something else with your spare time. G go shopping, have lots of sex, take more naps, anything but this. Time to wake up. Thank you. Again. Who are you? Doesn't matter. You won't remember anyway. Just go and never come back. Did she really just say, go do something like have lots of sex? I guess... Yeah, well, never mind. Okay, so... <laughs> <laughs> what can we do now? Like to... That dream is just total blackness. The absence of light. Can I look at one of the other ones? No. any closer. Who are you? Why are you here? Leave me alone. I'm just here to help, boy. You don't need to be so paranoid about it. The darkness. It's everywhere. It's getting closer. Oh man, I can't see anything. I can't leave. It's not safe out there, 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 there. Come with me. I'll help you escape. What? Who, who? Who are you? You're dreaming. I'll help you get back. Follow me. What's that? What's that part of the game? That audio repeat there? If it was, it's creepy as hell. It's one hell of a timing to glitch too. I hate the dark. I can't stand it. It's dark. It's too dark. I can't. I can't move. I can't go anywhere. It's too dark. Just way too dark. The darkness. It's getting closer. Wait a second. Can we turn on this light? Can we? Dreaming? No. That can't. That can't be. This this is too real. 
too real. That's because you're connected to a dream machine. If you remember nothing else when you wake up, remember this. Have lots the dream of sex? machines are dangerous. Don't use them, or you'll get stuck here, and maybe I won't find you again. Don't say that. Don't say that. I'll remember. I swear. I don't ever want to come back. I won't touch a dream machine again. That bulb won't last long. It's dark. The dark is everywhere. I have to go back. Back to the light. Huh. What if we do... See if that helps. Dark. The dark is everywhere. Come on, come on, come on. I have to go back. Back to the light. Oh, come on, dude. Come on. The dark ain't that bad. Look, there's some light at the end of this tunnel. Wait, light at the end of the tunnel. I don't like where this is going. <laughs> I really don't like where this is going. Okay, keep walking. Let's activate this one as fast as we can. I like that we already got our first Stay little puzzle. Stay close to me and you'll be fine. <laughs> I hate the dark. <laughs> I can't stand it. You have a light within you. It's strong. But I don't... I don't know how to turn it on. Just stay close, and I'll keep it burning. Just promise me you'll stay far away from dream machines. You bet. I'm never connecting to dream time again. Not after this. Can you please help me find my way? I'm trying, but it seemed like I couldn't really do much with the last lamp over here. I'm really trying to help you. Oh, there we go. Okay. Come on, dude. It's safe over here. Drowning in it. The darkness is swallowing me up. He's absolutely terrified of the dark. We already figured that out, really. It's him. The source of the darkness. He's feeding it. His fear is totally out of control. He's fighting me and he doesn't even know it. He needs to stop or I can't help him. It's happening again. It's happening. The darkness. It's closing in. You're letting your fears control you. I hate the dark. I can't stand it. I know, and you're feeding it. You need to let it go. Your fears and worries. You have the power to banish this darkness, remember? The light within you? That's right. The dark makes me forget. So just let it go. Brighten up. Shine for me, you crazy diamond. But I don't... I don't know how to turn it on. You're not alone. I'm here to help you. <sighs> Thank you. Now shine for me like a disco ball. Please? There, that's much better. Now See? we should be able to go. All this time you carried the light within. There's nothing to be afraid of anymore. Thank you. 
What do these things mean? Well, I know this is a chat. Let's chat. Can you please help me find my way? Walk into the light. Walk into the... Don't worry, not that kind of light. You'll just wake up. Thank you. What is going on out there? It's getting worse. If this game is going to be filled with stuff like this, you're going to feel like a connection to everybody you help. Which isn't a bad thing, but holy crap, this will be one hell of a story. What is that? A bedroom. Bedroom. I know what that means. I don't really want to know. The way you said that, that could mean something. Uh... Oh god, let's just... There's a wardrobe, too, I think. It's... Yep, it's moving. And there's something in it. Oh, lovely. Oh, a kid that's afraid of the monster in his closet? What are you doing? Get away from there! Oh, yeah. Great. I used to be afraid of a monster in the closet. Yes, it sounds weird, but when I was younger, I actually was. So I can kinda... understand this girl. Shh. Don't make a sound. It will hear you. Who will? The monster in the closet. It will hear you and eat us both. She's scared enough or she's already scared, but she needs to understand how dangerous the dream machine is. She needs to be scared of what will happen if she keeps using it. She's scared enough already, poor girl. I need to be careful. She needs reassurance, not more things to be scared of. I understand the scare her part, but at this moment she doesn't need to be more scared than she already is, right? I just hope I... I am choosing the right option here. I promise it won't hurt you. You swear? I swear. I won't let it. But you need to get back home. I can't find my way. The way back is through there. Through the wardrobe. I can't go in there. It will eat me alive. Not if we destroy it first. Do you have the key? I don't know where it is. My mum locks it every night. And tells me to behave. Or should unlock it and let the monster have me? Great parenting. Don't worry, I'll find the key. And whatever's in there, it's no match for me, I promise. Are you like a superhero? Something like that. What do you think of my costume? It's really cool. But damn. The mother of that child should be slapped across the face for scaring that girl. Okay, let's go see. What the hell's this? Is this what she thinks is in the closet? If that's the case, I don't really want to open it myself. Let's see. She... She had... A light. Oh, she dropped it. It rolled away. She doesn't know where it is. She won't go looking for the light herself. She's afraid of the slithering things in the dark. Hey, who can blame her? Indeed, who can blame her? Don't tell me there's a monster under the bed, right? Too dark. Can't see anything under there. Being bringer of light. Emissary of electricity. The mighty torch. The mighty torch. 
Okay. Uh. Okay. Hmm. I do like the little sticker on it, though. Okay, so where are we going? Oh, seriously? Oh, that's interesting. That's one disturbed wardrobe. I'm glad this is not my dream. I'd be absolutely terrified. Not peeking inside that thing's head. I've made that mistake in the past, never again. Light could work, but I don't think there's anything to draw on there. That thing is darkness, through and through. It would need to come from somewhere else. Okay. So can I talk to the girl, though? Yes, I can. Oh, she must be terrified. Poor girl. Where am I supposed to look with this thing? Can I put it away? Torch. Flashlight. Beacon. How can I- oh, I take it back. It's too quick. It hides before I can destroy it. It's too quick. I hides before I can destroy it. Oh. It's too quick. It hides before I can destroy it. Yeah, it actually does. Can I, like, if I turn like this? Oh, that's cool. That's awesome. That actually is awesome. Locked. And locked dream wardrobes don't open without dream keys. There's a logic to it. Well, not all dreams are illogical. Whoever wired her to a dream machine should be locked away for a very long time. It's probably her mother. Okay, but now we got this done, right? I need a key to open this. Yes, we need a key, but can we just dream a key and get it over with? Tentacles, be gone. Hello, boring old wardrobe. Mm, nope, still creepy. Oh, okay. Oh. Ah, okay. Got something. A key. Oh, I'm I'm loving this game already. It's so interesting and I just feel for the poor girl. I need a key to open this. I got a key to open this. No, don't get too close. It will take you. See, it's gone. You're safe now. Thank you. But I don't know how to get back home. I don't know where my mummy is. She's on the other side of the wardrobe waiting for you. It's... It's scary. Whatever was in there, it's gone now. I promise. Come on. Do you use a dream machine? Mum makes me. She says it keeps me occupied. Then she has time to play with hers. The next time she does that, you need to say no. She won't like that. Maybe not. But you tell her it's dangerous, that it gives you nightmares. And if she refuses to listen, tell someone else. Or scream, fight back, run away, just... Never ever use a dream machine. I could tell Daddy. He doesn't live with us, but I talk to him all the time. You do that. Now go through and you'll wake up again. Thank you. What's your name? Zoe. And remember, no dream time. I might not be able to find you again. This has to stop. 
Slap your mother for me on the other side of the <laughs> wardrobe. Sounds like a upright bitch, and who the hell is that? <laughs>